Hey guys, so welcome to the new lecture of Krishna Theatre. Today we will discuss about the topic algorithm. Algorithm and it, this topic is also known as design and analysis of algorithm and short form of this topic are DA. In, so first thing is to know the definition of algorithm. If you read any subject, you should know the definition of that subject or what is the meaning of that subject. So, so what is algorithm? So algorithm is nothing but it is So what is an algorithm? Algorithm is a sequence of finite step to solve a problem or you can say it as, can say it as finite set of instructions. So what is an algorithm? Algorithm is finite set of instructions. Now you will tell if algorithm is finite set of instructions then what is the difference between algorithm and program? So Algorithm is finite set of instruction. It can be written in any simple language such as English or anything. So difference between algorithm and program is it can be written algorithm. Algorithm can be written in any simple language. It does not depend on type of language. It takes only procedure. Okay, guys. Program is written in a specific language. Program is written in a specific language like C or C or Java. So algorithm only tells the procedure to write a program. Algorithm is set of instructions which can be written in the copy or paper. But program is written in certain specific language such as C, C++ and Java. There are certain criteria which is keep in mind to make a algorithm. Criteria for algorithm. Criteria for algo. First criteria for algo is input. You should take zero or more input. If you have to print uh, like hello world, then you will take zero input. And if you have to perform some specific addition, multiplication, or specific tasks, and you need an input, then you will take an input. So criteria for algorithm. First criteria is input. Second criteria is output. So an algorithm should produce a desired or specific output. Hmm. Uh, algorithm must pro produce output. Algorithm that does not produce any uh, output is useless or meaningless. So we can say algo must produce specific output algo with no specific output is useless. Third criteria for algorithm is finite list. It means it does not contain infinite loop or it have an ending. So third criteria is finite list and algo should have ending. And fourth criteria is definiteness so an algorithm does not produce a, an, a, an ambiguous me, an ambiguous meaning or confusing meaning so algorithm should be clear it means algo should be an ambiguous and 
clear it means it will produce only one meaning it does not make a lot of confusion and last criteria is effectiveness so effectiveness means it every instruction should be clear it should not be complex if problem is weak big we will break down it into smaller problem if problem is big or complex we will split it into a smaller problem so that's all are the criteria of algorithm now we will see property of algorithm properties of algo first property it should take finite time to produce output so it it is fulfilling the criteria of finiteness now second properties should produce correct output this property fulfill the criteria of definiteness and third property is algo should be unambiguous it means it is or it should be non confusing it will produce only one meaning for a task should take zero or more input it means algorithm should take zero or more input if you have to produce hello world then you will take zero input and if you have to produce sum or something you have to perform something specific task then you will uh, you should take some input from user should be independent of programming language so last and fifth property of algorithm is it should be independent of programming language because algorithm is procedure it can be written on paper in any language like english also so it should be independent of programming language it means you can write procedure that was so these are the property of algorithm in later lecture we will discuss about time complexity and analysis of algorithm and greedy approach thank you for watching if you have watched, if you have like this video please give us thumbs up and subscribe our channel thank you for watching